Good evening and welcome back to PGA Tour 2K23 again. This time I thought we'd try something a little bit different. So I'm going to give a course I've been meaning to try for quite a while ago tonight um, called Bull Kraken Island. So it's a par 3 course. I've only seen a few screenshots of it. I haven't seen any gameplay. haven't seen how difficult or easy it might be. But I thought change things up a bit. Give it a go. You never know, we might get our second hole in one. We've still only hit the one so far. Let's just jump in and we'll see what the course is like. So, on to the first tee. And as you can see, it's a relatively short par 3. So it's 122, about 120 with the uh, downhill. And then you're looking about 108, 110. With um, with the wind, so I'm probably going to take put a bit of loft on, a little bit of spin. Aim, I think I'm going to aim, yeah, about let's say 108. And obviously with the wind, I'm going to aim a little bit right, uh, left. Now if it goes right, that's fine because we've got this nice little slope back into the green, into the hole rather. This is looking good. Very nice. It'd be lovely to get a hole on one at some point on this course. Whoop, is it rolling back a bit? It's heading towards the hole there. Now, I don't know if this course is intended for people to easily get an ace or not. Or just by chance, whether that first hole's a relatively easy one. Well, well, here we go. So this is a lot longer. So that seems to answer it a little bit. So you're playing 211, down 52. So what we're going to want to take that off. Uh, probably take about 17 off. So it's about 195. It's probably playing about 190. I think 187 would do it. And again, wins left to right. So probably going to aim that sort of way. Again, there is a bit of a slope helping from right to left. Slow down. Slow down. Ooh. Is there by any chance of slope that brings it back down? Let's speed it up a bit. Oh no. Oh! Oh, so close. Very close. On to the third, which is uh, 172 uphill. So that's playing about 175, 176. And wind right to left. So again, maybe. Yeah, about there should do. Slow down. Oh, way too hard. Come back, come back. No, it's not going to come back. No. I've never tried putting off the green as of yet. Um, okay, maybe let's not do that. Very nice. Nice chip in there. Okay, so on to the fourth, and this is only 136 yards. It's up 23. So that's playing at about 144. 134 with the wind. Ooh. I'm going to, yeah, a bit of loft. Take the shot before the wind decides to change his mind and start moving. Come back down, come back down towards the hole. Come on, 
Ah, close. Yeah, I can definitely see some hole in one opportunities on this one. Ooh, okay. So this is 224, but it's down 51, which again is about 17. So this is playing about 207 and about 197 with the wind. Yeah, I think if we play it at this bit of loft, bit of spin. Oh shit. Let's hit that one. And again, I've way over hit it. Um, my distance is way off today. Another chip in. Oh, close. Okay, so this is the first headwind. Um, 168 to the pin. So that's playing about 148. It's playing about 160 with a wind. Um, Yeah, don't want to put too much loft on because by the time it gets there, the wind's just going to absolutely knock it out of the sky. Which it has done, but this might roll a little bit. If it bounces forward a little bit. Come on. Turn, 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 turn. Ah. Oop. Come on. Go. Ah. Oh. We're definitely playing this course again. Um, so this will play at about 175, maybe about 180. The low 180s, um, I think if I add a bit of D loft. And aim sort of just at that left crest there. That should be about right. Now that looks pretty good. This looks good. Turn. Right, it's going to come back round. There's a bit of a slope here, so it's going to come back down. Will it? Will it? Ah. Close again. Okay, so this one is. You need to take about 13 off, so that's about 106. Um, do we. Yeah, I think if we add a bit of D loft. Bit of D loft. And there is a slope here that will go left. Go. Turn, 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 turn. Nope, it's going to come back round. Yes, but not enough. So, this one plays as 159. About 148. Say about here. Um, just want this wind to just want it to just on the edge and then. It's that slope and comes back down. That's 
Looking good. Go on. Yes! Get in there. Hole in one. That's our second hole in one. Whew. Good stuff. Um, 149. I mean, this course is clearly made for hole in one hunters, isn't it? Um, come on, turn back round, turn back. Keep going. Turn right a bit. Come on. Hasn't got quite enough momentum, has it? No. You could see it, though. I think it was on just about the right line. Okay, so this is playing about 165, 150. Yeah. Probably about 150, I would say. Because that wind does give a bit, bit of momentum as well when it touches on the green. Ooh, a little bit too much momentum. Now, is there a little bit of a backstop? There should be. Turn left, turn left. Come on, come on. Yes! That's number two! <laughs> uh, okay, this is a little bit easier than I thought. Um, but I'm, I'm enjoying it. You know, that's the main thing. Um, pitch. One. Right, that's it. Wait, so it's going to reach the backstop. It's going to turn a bit left and come back down. It's about the right line. It's about the right line. Yes! <laughs> back to back aces. Back to back aces. <coughs> Excuse me. Ah. Uh. Okay, so I think this one's quite simple game over here. This is going to filter in. Um, the wind is helping it a little bit. So it should just roll to the right. Then back down the slope. Now look, this looks like it might be a little bit... No, it stopped quite sharply. Go on. Ah. Being a bit greedy there. So, play about 202, 92, yeah I'm going to play it like that, let's see if that works, power a little bit, overpower that, oh didn't aim far enough left. It's took a little bit of a bounce though, which is good. That forces it to come back round. Very nice. And on to the 15th. Down 77, so that's down what? Uh, say about 25, so that's playing at about 170. We'll play it, say about 170, maybe about 165 with the wind. Um, yeah, that's about right. And again, there's a little slope 
left to right there so it's a bit got a bit of heat in it but it's on this upslope so it's going to come back down filter towards the hole and again there's a bit of a slope here so it's going to filter back down go on you know you want to go on go on Very close. Okay, so this is playing about 162, then about 172 with the wind. That's a turn. Take a little bounce forward. A little bounce. Go. Go, go, go. So two holes left. Can we get another hole in one? Um Just put a bit of D-loft on, which should cancel out the wind a little bit. Bounce right. Come on. Ah, uh, no. Ooh. No, not enough momentum there. And on to the last. It's only... Oh dear God, how am I supposed to? Uh, right. Well, I can't really see what's going on. Which doesn't help too much. But I'm hoping to hit it a little bit past the hole. And it'll spin, but I put a bit of spin on and it's on a upslope. Go on, go on. Yes! Get in there. Well, that was definitely an interesting course. Um, I would definitely play it again just for a bit of fun, but it's obviously not really a serious. I'm going to rate it five stars just for fun. Not for my fun, I mean, it's a fun course. Yeah, so we managed to hit our first hole in one on the ninth. We hit back to back on 11th and 12th. And then we've hit one on the last as well. So, yeah, I'm happy with that. But that was it. Yeah, just thought I'd try something different. A little bit of fun. Go on hole-in-one chasing. Didn't actually think I was going to get any. I'd certainly recommend anyone to play it. Especially if you're trying to get that achievement for the, the hole-in-one. And if you're struggling. I did manage to get my first one on just a normal course. It was actually Pro Spartan Gamers course. His first course. It was on a, a genuine par 3. With fairly flat greens. And you know there was nothing purposely trickling towards the hole or anything. But yeah that was fun. Really enjoyed it. Next time I think we'll have a go on like a, a lot tougher course. Any recommendations leave them in the comments below. Be happy to try something a little bit more competitive. Challenging. A bit like the Predator course that I tried a while back. That was really difficult. Yeah, but like I say, if you can like the video, if you did enjoy it, drop a comment down below for any suggestions and subscribe if you'd like to see any more videos of mine in the future. Thank you very much everyone and I'll see you all soon.